Yes, today is Friday, March 10th. Please join Miss Glow class for the, for the Pledge of Allegiance and the Shade of Promise. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. As a Shady Brook student, I promise to be at school on time and to do my very best each day. I promise to be safe. I promise to be respectful. I promise to be responsible. I promise to be... The weather for today calls for... Today for lunch, today you may choose between whole grain pizza or beefy nuts. We would like to wish a happy birthday today, March 21st, to Danielle Hernandez, Angeles, Betsida, Renteria, Renteria, Mate. Mate, and Nasir Samuels on Sunday, March 23rd. Josh Murph will celebrate a birthday. Happy birthday. Be enjoying a field trip to the Discovery Place today. Did you know the first ever t tweet was made on this day in 2006? This is a place where goats nibble, bunnies jump, and chicks hatch. Here you will discover many things, like what do we get from sheep? Why do pigs like mud? And so many new words. And the reading fun doesn't stop when you reach the end of the book. After you read this book, download your free digital book with lots of fun activities. Because when you read more and do more, you will discover more. Look for Scholastic Discover More Petting Zoo at your Scholastic Book Fair. Her name is Princess, and her last name is Pink. She does not like fairies, or princesses, or even the color pink. Blech. She does like dirty sneakers, giant bugs, mud puddles, monster trucks, and jumping off things she's not supposed to. Way cool! Her story begins when she opens her refrigerator and falls into the land of fake belief. Fake belief? Yes, that's correct. And this is where she meets Mother Moose. Don't you mean Mother Goose? No, Moose. Mother Moose. Now, one thing that happens is her hair turns pink. My hair is pink? I can't stand pink. And then she meets Moldylocks. Not Goldilocks? Moldylocks. And they're off to see the three beards. Any questions about that? No bears? You still don't get it, do you? Moldylocks. Three beards. Fake belief. I won't even mention the tuna corn. A tuna corn? Oh, just forget it. Go to your Scholastic Book Fair. Find the first book in the Princess Pink and the Land of Fake Believe series. It's Moldy Locks and the Three Beards. And just read it. You'll see what I'm talking about, and you'll laugh your head off. Ew, a missing head? That sounds way cool. 